So I need to talk to you guys about John Krasinski, who you probably know from The Office and A Quiet Place and lots of other things. Well, recently he started a news show called Some Good News from his house during this quarantine where he talks about all the positive things that are happening in the world right now. But I have a theory that John is actually being held against his will and has possibly been kidnapped and is leaving little signs in the videos to try and warn viewers to send help. Now, the first thing that got me on this train of thought was actually in this image of him right here. Well, if you zoom a little bit closer and look in the glare in his eye, look what you can see. And if you still can't see it, let me zoom in as close as I can get. What the hell is that? It appears to be the reflection of some sort of black limousine. And I thought, well, why is there a black limo in his room facing him like this? So I started to do some research, and I remember that his last name is Krasinski, which is Polish. So I started looking into Polish culture, and I come across Polish folklore, and there is a famous Polish creature known as the Black Volga, or Volga. I'm going to say Volga. And it says that in the 1960s and early 70s, there is a black limo that would roam the streets and kidnap people to steal their blood and give it to sick people and some other weird stuff. But then I thought, well, how could John Krasinski have been kidnapped by this car when he lives in the United States? But then I found out that he actually visited Poland a few years ago to learn about his heritage. And here's a picture of that here. But then as I'm looking at this image, I noticed this book they're holding. And I thought, what does that book say on the cover? It's hard to read. So I used technology to clarify it. And it clearly says, spooky plan to kidnap John. Then on top of that, during one of the episodes he was filming, I saw these two glares and it appears that the Black Volga forgot to turn its headlights off. Then on top of that, I find another image of John Krasinski riding in a black limo on the internet. And look at his face. He looks very concerned. Normally when you're riding in a black limo, you're pretty happy because you're going somewhere cool. But he clearly looks like he's been kidnapped here. So I start combing through his videos and he's clearly giving hand signs to try and tell people to come save him. So look at these four images in a row and look at his hands. Clearly he's trying to spell help. Now, before you click off this video, I already know what you guys are thinking. James, you're a stupid pig. We hate this channel. I hate this video. Thumbs down unsubscribe, your parents don't love you, and you'll never amount to anything. And trust me, no one thinks that more than me. In fact, I wrote those exact words in my diary this morning. But if you give me a second, I actually did some math that I think proves this theory to be 100% true. So check this out. J. Kra was born October 20th, 1979, and Poland officially became a country in 1918. So if you take John's birthday and you subtract the 1918, it gives you 61. So I thought, well, what does 61 mean? So I look online and I find this movie review and 61 one out of 135 people found the review helpful. And guess what movie that was for? The movie Kidnap. What a coincidence. Now this movie stars Halle Berry and Halle Berry has 10 letters in her name. Five and five. And I thought, hmm, 10. What does that mean? Well, it just so happens that John Krasinski got married on July 10th, 2010. And he got married to Emily Blunt, who was born in 1983. Now Emily Blunt's name also has 10 letters. Five and five, the same thing. So if you take the year she was born, 1983, and subtract the 10 letters from her name, it gives you 1973. And guess what just happened to come out in 1973? A certain movie called Black Volga, the movie that was made about John's kidnapper. So clearly everything adds up here and I think I've proven this theory to be true. So someone needs to help John Krasinski and I'm willing to do it, I just need a sign. But on a side note, my Patreon supporters are still locked in my basement and I decided to celebrate Polish culture with them. So I hand fed them a couple of Polish sausages and they loved it. So if you wanna join the Patreon supporters in my basement, there's a link to my Patreon in the description. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.